Hello everyone, my name is uh, Victor Young, and I'm the CEO of Flinja, where we are revolutionizing the way people connect with and hire local skilled talent around the world. Now, did you guys know that more than 53% of recent college grads are finding themselves under or unemployed, yet there are millions of jobs left unfilled? You see, students need experience to get these jobs but they also need a job to get experience. And trust me, I should know. Previously, I found a company called Enet, where I had hired over 500 employees and contractors. And upon reviewing the resumes of thousands of recent college grads, I noticed all of them had one thing in common. They were all inexperienced. You see, they didn't have the experience to fill these jobs. And sure, students could upload their resumes on sites like LinkedIn or other job sites, but without the relevant job and work experience, it's pointless. And that is exactly the reason why only 3% of LinkedIn's users are between the ages of 18 to 24. You see, these sites, they just don't get students' jobs. But Flinja does. See, Flinja is a platform where students can gain skills, and build relevant work experience completing projects. And on the flip side, we allow startups and big companies alike to quickly test out the talent of tomorrow at a fraction of the cost. See, we transform people into freelance ninjas. Flinges. Now, since launching, we already have over 100,000 students in the system, many of which are getting hired each and every single day. But we're not just going to stop at 100,000 students, you see. In fact, we've only begun. Please allow me to introduce to you Flinja Mobile. Now, anyone can monetize off their expertise. So let me show you how this works. Suppose I'm a Frenchman, and I'm here in San Francisco for the first time. Now, everything seems a bit foreign to me. I love exploring cities, but I absolutely, absolutely hate trying to figure out which restaurants to go to, which sites to see, you know, just trying to get around in general. It's a waste of my time. It's a waste of my money. So I love to hire someone local to help translate and be my personal guide. I need help, and I need it right now. And sure, I could do a search on Google for French English translators. I could even go on Craigslist as well. I could even wait at my hotel concierge for assistance. Or I could simply flip out my Flinja app and do a quick search for French English translators here in San Francisco, located within a few blocks of me. Now, the search results display a map of available GPS-located Flinjas that offer translation as a service. So Marie Bernard looks great. Let's go ahead and uh, click on her and learn a little bit more about her. Now, as you guys can see, she goes to the University of San Francisco. She majors in French. And she even has a couple reviews, which look great. But what I love most is that she has marked herself as available to work right now. So before hiring her, we go ahead and message back and forth, and I even call her to discuss the job details. She agrees to meet me outside my hotel. Now, upon arriving, but before commencing the job, she goes ahead and hits the Start Job button on the phone. Time is now ticking. After spending hours guiding me through San Francisco, the job is finally done, so she goes ahead and hits the end job button on her phone. And now, this will now present a receipt screen for me to rate and review Marie, and also automatically charge my credit card. This is simplicity at its best. Now, in case you guys might be wondering, well, how do you guys make money? Well, it's quite simple. You see, we charge a 15% transaction fee but it's already baked into the price at hiring. So for example, if you're a Flinja, and let's say you charge 20 an hour, we'll go ahead and showcase this on our site for 23. 
And you guys also might be wondering, well, how about your market size? Well, let's look at the college student demographic. There are 21 million college students in this country. And each and every single one of them could benefit from gaining relevant work experience while in school. But even if we just get one out of 10, that's right, just one out of every 10 college student, just one job, just one, in the next four years of their college career, we're gonna hit 300 million in transaction volume per year. Now let me show you the team execute on this. It's a veteran team with years of experience working at such companies as Google, eBay, PayPal, Cisco, and Microsoft. And with degrees from such places as Stanford, University of Waterloo, Caltech, and Warren at UPenn. And we're currently raising $3 million, of which we already have two and a half committed. It's our Series A round, by the way. And includes investors such as Howard Marks, co-founder of Activision, Fred Smith, chairman, CEO, and founder of FedEx, and also Kaplan Ventures. And a firm here in Silicon Valley we can't name yet, but we will soon in a month. We're also accepting pre-registrations for the Flinja mobile product. So you can go on flinja.com slash mobile. Um, so for everyone in the audience right now, you can pre-register either as a customer or as a Flinja. We are hiring as well. We are hiring the best of the best. So if you're a, uh, a business development exec, you're someone in PR or marketing, you're a growth hacker, or you are a brilliant engineer, please reach out to us. We have an email, launchjobs at flinja.com. Uh, we expect to grow very quickly, not only in the United States, but also internationally as well. Now, before I leave the stage today, I'd like all of you to remember three last things. Number one, we're a veteran team that knows how to scale. You see, we've done this before. Second, employers are currently hiring our flinjas daily. We make money. And last but not least, 21 million college students need our product. Once again, my name is Victor Young. I'm the CEO of Flinja. I'd like to invite all of you to join us in our mission to revolutionize the way people connect with and hire local skilled talent across the world. Thank you very much. So now we'll take some questions from the audience. I'm living in Sweden. Oh. Hands. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. I, uh, I, uh, my question is, okay, so with the previous company, we saw some, um, he was focusing on the merits of, of going for a vertical. And you're going for a, a provider sector with college students, which means your vertical is broad and, and limited by their capacities. Um, would you say that people, you, you expect people to, to come to a, an app like yours um, looking for a broad range of services and, and would that be something that goes against what he was saying about the merits, merits of focusing on a vertical? Right. Uh, okay, so that's a very good question. The, the quick answer is we know which verticals, or we're launching with certain verticals. Uh, with our mobile app. So we have a legacy product, which is what I was explaining before, uh, during the first half of the presentation. Um, the legacy product, we know which verticals, uh, for example, like you know, uh, design or uh, content creation, those are typically things that uh, do pretty well on our platform. The mobile product is in the physical space. So what we are, what we're doing now with this launch is starting with eight particular verticals. Obviously one is translation, uh, another one's healthcare. Um, they're mostly, they're, they're not mundane services. They're not blue collar for the most, they're, they're more white collar. So they're, I think it's gonna take uh, a bit of iteration. Um, there's a lot of analytics involved to determine what ultimately is going to stick. Uh, but there are, I think in one of the slides, there was uh, eight verticals that I, I sh showed. I think one of them was like makeup as well, makeup or beauty. Um, what we wanna do here is is basically create the foundation to start tracking skilled work. I'm not talking about the, uh, the task rabbits of the world, 
uh, or the handy books of the world, right? We want to track things that you and I do, perhaps even on a contract basis or on a freelance basis, but just isn't being tracked digitally right now, right? So that, that's where we differentiate. Uh, again, the verticals are still, um, you know, we are, we're going to be launching on App Store uh, within about 30 days. They will change. It will be subject to change based on the data that we collect. Hey, um, it's pretty easy to say you're going to get one in 10 college students. What are your customer acquisition channels? Any projections there? Yeah, so that, that's also a very good question. We, uh, we partner with the career centers, for example, at all the various universities. We're open right now at 15 universities. Um, I think the value add that we bring, the value prop is very clear. We are a Kaplan Ventures backed company, so it, it's, it's easy since they're, they have a foothold in all the campuses to kind of get in and, and start uh, talking about how we can provide value for their students to connect them to, uh, to these jobs, all right? Um, so that, that's how we spread. We use our, we, the distribution channel is pretty clear. We use the career centers to help us. Uh, there are other kind of guerrilla marketing tactics we use too, um, but that, that's our, probably our biggest channel, so I don't know. Any questions? Oh, I have one. Um, so you've touched a little bit on how you're getting more and more students to come into your platform. What kind of jobs are most common that you're seeing put out for these flinges? Um, so we, again, we've got a lot of product lines. Uh, for the legacy product, which is the, the web product, the virtual work, uh, copy or content creation. Uh, so a lot of the, the remember, we're, we're helping mostly the 99% of students, right? The 1% of you guys are, are engineers, are very technical people. I'm a very technical person. Um, but the other 99% are nothing against them, but they're studying, you know, they're, they're in the liberal arts, they're doing, you know, anthropology, sociology. I have a lot of friends that don't really have a technical degree. So those people are the ones that use our product the most, right? Those are the guys, that the content creators, um, which is our, our, the, the number one service being offered on our system, or, or being hired for. And also, uh, after that, design, uh, the, you know, the, the normal things you would find in, in other marketplaces, so design and coding as well. Um, business, so sales, but content creation definitely is the, is the top one. Yeah. Oh. Sure. Yeah, so the career, we partner with the career centers right now. We partner with the career centers to seed both sides of the market. We actually have a, a, um, a career portal product, um, which is basically just a white label solution of what we've built thus far that universities um, pay money for, essentially, or, or, uh, or build into their product right now, and that helps seed both sides of the marketplace. So I took your advice and I just sa signed up and I'm, sure. I'm on a waiting list. You're on the waiting list. Uh, why, why are you on the waiting list? Exactly. My question. Yeah. Why am I? On which the uh, which list? school did you go to? Or I went here to San Francisco State University, but that wasn't part of the sign. Oh, up. for the mobile. I'm sorry. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, got it. Got it. Okay. Yeah. The mobile's not launched yet. Yeah. So the mobile product is launching in 30 days. About 30 days. Yeah. <laughs> Too early. <laughs> All right. Great. Well, let's give. A